Hi there, uh, just a quick video on a common issue we get and it's an RCD fault. So just first of all I want to tell you what an RCD is, it's a residual current device. It's a very clever bit of kit and it keeps you guys safe. You should have these at home whether it's two or more but uh, that's for another day. So clever bit of kit, it monitors the energy going out and coming back and ultimately if the energy coming back isn't pretty much the same as what's going out, it's going to trip. It'll also trip on our neutral earth fault as well. So that's what they are. Um, what you guys should be doing is testing them every six months, which is simply just press the button and it will trip, uh, reset it, happy days. That's all you need to do every six months. Now, if you've got an RCD fault, which is pretty common, I would say it's about 50-50% of the chance it's going to be an appliance or an issue with your actual electrical installation. So the first thing you should do, which is the first thing we do, therefore you'd be as well doing it, saving some time and money. Unplugging all your plugs in the house, don't be tempted just to switch them off, physically unplug them, then put them back in one at a time. Um, so ultimately you're just trying to work out via a process of elimination what it might be. Now it might get a little bit more tricky because it might be something like a washing machine which only trips sometimes and also at a spe specific time in the cycle. But ultimately you're trying to work out if it's an appliance or one or an issue in your installation. So if it's an appliance, you're going to have to get somebody to look at that appliance or possibly get rid of it. That's up to you. If there's a if you can't fix it by, by doing the thing with unplugging stuff. Really, you're going to have to contact a registered electrician. You'll first of all test the RCD to make sure it's working. Um, that, that's a really quick test, um, but they also might have to test your installation. So, hope this has been of help. And uh, if you've got any questions or queries, please get in touch. Thanks a lot. Bye bye.